What's up fellas, welcome back to the channel, Mr. Schnitzel in the house, and in today's video I'm gonna talk about the Gravedigger. This tank, what are you seeing here right now, can be yours, and this completely for free at this event which started just a few minutes ago, the Mad Arena. So we can get this vehicle just for winning battles, so if you win battles you will, you will get one of those mastery emblems uh, I mean sorry you ob obtain mastery emblems and we can get mastery emblems just for winning battles actually it doesn't it doesn't matter win or lose just for getting mastery badges mastery badge class 3 you can get one class 2 three emblems class 1 seven emblems and ace tank and mastery badge you can get for that 15 mastery emblems those mastery emblems will get you this rewards, okay? But what we need to get um, the grave digger, ten of those number plates, okay? And we can see there we can get at level four one, at level eight another one, already two, and at level twelve you can get whatever how much you want from those uh, number plates that means you need to win a lot of battles in the next 10 days from now 9 days and 24 hours Let's say 10 days in the next battles to win as much as you can or to get it doesn't matter win or lose as I told you just need Mastery badges. Let's say you are an average player and You get each battle second class mastery badge, which is really not that difficult. Okay second class mastery badge Okay in average that means three emblems each battle that means how much do we need to get this 74 74 to get uh the first um number plate 10 battles 20 battles already 60 so yeah kind of um 25 battles and you got already um three and then you will need nine that means for each another a uh, number plate you winning for that three battles okay so it's really not that difficult and um, another 27 battles let's say so in total maybe 50 battles minimum 50 battles maybe a bit more maximum six, 60 battles I would say and you can get your grave digger completely for free after that to get those 20 of those you can get also also one of those tank grave digger smasher annihilator um, scavenger or the spike also just from opening those containers which is very very uh, insane for me i'm gonna do absolutely a huge opening and open all those crates because it's, it's really very interesting for me if i get one of those tanks that means it's uh, gold for free for me because i have all the tanks and i can get the gold the gold compensation that's really a pretty insane vehicle a lot of gold for players who got the tanks already but also uh the grave digger completely for free and for sure if you just let's say roundabout to win 50 or play 55 battles and you get always your second class mastery badge really not that difficult and uh, you should just go for it guys i'm gonna play also one battle with you here freestyle with my grave digger to showcase you again of this vehicle, let's do it. So for me, I really played a lot with the tank in fun modes. Um, the tank don't have the best gun depression, and that's really the only problem. What I hate about the tank, and this tank got six shells in the magazine, which can be really a lot of fun. Um, the armor of this tank is really insane. The frontal armor is really so trollish, so annoying to penetrate the frontal armor of the tank, especially if you are playing against tier 6 and tier 7s. We can really rely a lot of our armor. If you are playing against tier 8s, we need to be careful, especially against tier 8 heavies and TDs. Also, tier 7 TDs will not have big problems to penetrate uh, the frontal armor of our vehicle. But the rest of the tanks will have some problems to do so. Um, yeah. I'm trying to push here, medium side, and to do some damage. Let's have a look. Here we go. Already one shot on that Y5 ELC. Another one. Going for 90 da 92 damage. So we can deal, let's say, 
something about 90 to 100 of damage per shot and we got six shells okay this right again with a premium shell maybe here we go so till now three I blocked three shots from the enemy as I told you um, they will have really big problems to penetrate our um, frontal armor as we can see here okay um, the T-54 is really confused he didn't fire on me because he just couldn't pen my frontal armor that's insane perfect battle battle nice showcase to uh, yeah show you this vehicle I don't know we're going to win this battle or not but till now this tank is doing really pretty good here in this battle I mean oh, we have tigers running away already but I don't want to mess with that tank because I know that he can pen me very easy I will try to finish maybe the SU if possible, but I can't as well. So let's go this way. The SU is destroyed. Perfect. And see what's going on here. Well, I know that the Yak Tiger is waiting for me, but I'm gonna risk a shot. Who knows? Just one shot, maybe. We can scratch them. No penetration at all. Sadly. That one didn't go through. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Okay, at least I distracted the enemy so that my teammates maybe can finish the Löwe. The Yak Tiger is still staring at me, I guess. Yep. I'm gonna chill here first, until he move away somewhere else. Oh bro, how did I miss that? Let's push on him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We want to win this battle. Where is he going right now? Oh, bro. What the silencer is doing, man? Do something, dude. He's hiding right there. Are you kidding me, man? Come on, finish him. Oh, bro. He didn't finish him. Okay, not bad, not bad. I was somehow stuck, I couldn't penetrate the Yak Tiger and this is also one of the problems of this vehicle which is, as I told you, the gun depression firstly and uh, the gun penetration, also not the best what we have here on this vehicle, but the rest is really a solid vehicle that wasn't the best battle in point of damage this, but yeah, it is how it is, sometimes you have battles with when you don't do a lot of damage, but that doesn't mean that I didn't did my job here in this battle, I distracted the enemy, I blocked a lot of damage, did a lot of them, uh, some of damage, and we won this battle. That's the most important, and that was a showcase about this tank. I mean, it's for free, okay? Looks so nice, it's a good credit maker, and uh, this vehicle is actually more meant to be played in fun modes, like right now, mad games, or gravity forest, we can ram a lot. This tank got really a lot of funny abilities and effective abilities on fun modes which make it a lot of fun to play in fun mode, especially especially we have also here six shells in the magazine, so absolutely a fun tank for um, fun modes, mad games, uprising, gravitizing, whatever, gravity force, um, yeah. And it's for free guys, I mean, who is going to complain? If you can get this vehicle here right now for free, just go for it. Um, I told you how in this video so good luck grinding this tank and maybe see you soon i'm gonna go today maybe live stream to grind with you this tank for, for all of you who don't have it already maybe we can platoon together and we can try to uh, yeah grind this tank together see you there bye bye tankers